Long time no chat. <laughs> What's up? Seems like we have a good group here. Well, veteran Suvia, my girls. Get along well. Lots of mutual respect. As far as your Hyperion peeps go, the doc's kind of nosy. Liam's good for a laugh or two. Cora, she's a bit by the book for me. Need somebody to keep the zoo in check. Zoo? You you calling me an animal rider? Uh, ooh, can I be a mongoose? They're like cool cobra killers. No, wait, how about a crow? Smart, irreverent, obnoxious. That's it. I'll take your word for it. <laughs> <laughs> what about Callow? He's a pilot. Which means... He flies the ship. We're leaving it at that, then? Does a Pathfinder know what to do with a dead end? I hear we have you to thank for getting the Tempest space ready so quickly. Vetra brings her impossible feats to me. I was itching to get this particular call. Capital R, ready. Don't tell her, but the truth is, I fudge reports to come in early, then bust ass in secret to make up for him. Expands the Gil legend. Plus, I convey calm and assurance, and the whole team relaxes, which helps them do their jobs better. What's your social circle like? I'm good for a laugh, so I know lots of people, but I don't let too many in. My one true friend is stationed on the Nexus. She's the only piece of the Milky Way I brought with me. The more you and I get to know each other, the more you'll probably hear about her. How tough has it been on the Nexus all these months? Have you ever eaten overcooked space cow tongue? Hasn't everyone? Well then you know, it's super tough. Wondering if you're gonna die from a critical malfunction, or maybe starvation. Imagining which would be worse. But hey, you could always take a break from the fear and boredom to dwell on being a part of the biggest failure in galactic history. Maybe even participate in a revolt. What was your take on that? I didn't place any bets, if that's what you're asking. Truth is, I don't think anyone made out particularly well. Whatever side you're on, you die a little when your brother, your teammate, becomes an enemy. We traveled all this way, all hope and wonder, and we end up fighting with each other over scraps. It's sad. Good talking to you, Gil. Anytime. <laughs>